Hello everyone, it is Haida Tots here and welcome back to another episode of that Tater Thursdays action where I will be reading your would you rather questions and this week I hope you left me just a little more than the three questions we had last week. That was kind of sad. I was deeply sad inside. Iceberg was crying water because he was ice and he's melting so it creates water. I don't even know where I'm going with that, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to read your would you rather questions. So I hope they're good and I hope they're juicy. I do like some juicy questions. Okay, sorry friend. Would you rather learn piano or guitar? Guitar. There's a lot. Mm, I would say there's more songs that I know that I thoroughly enjoy that use the guitar more than songs I know that use the piano. I know a few good songs that use the piano, but like majority of my songs use guitar and if I could learn to play that thing and play it like a beauty I would absolutely love that and I could play my favorite songs on the guitar but I don't know if I'm learning that anytime soon <sighs> I can pretty much just play uh, the Spotify great instrument all I have to do is click play and uh, it, it comes out perfectly every time it's my favorite instrument otherwise yeah guitar I'd love to learn a guitar maybe maybe one day not anytime soon though I got better things to do yeah, actually, I don't know. I don't know what better things I have to do, but I have better things to do. Would you rather be Captain America or Hulk? So if I'm Hulk, I'm massive, I'm green, I'm super strength. If I'm Captain America, I have a shield, but I think I'm a regular dude. I don't know. I think I like Captain America better, but I don't need to be a giant buffed up green boy. I mean, I'm already buff. I mean, I mean, okay. Maybe not, but I'd love to be Captain America. I just think his shield and how far he can throw it and how hard he can throw it. I could do some pretty cool stuff with that shield. And uh, those spandex, I think they look good on me. Ah, oh, I keep forgetting to leave a freaking comment. Jafia, 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 Jafia. You had one job, Jafia. Why do I even do this anymore? What is that? Oh, you actually did leave a question. Oh, okay, we're good this week. <laughs> but you better be there next week. But for this week, we're all good. Would you rather go through the zombie apocalypse or live through a nuclear explosion? Do you spell that right? Explosion. Oh, you put a T instead of an S. Exploition. Explo- Sorry, picky. And survive the chaos it creates. Uh, yes, I choose to not do deep question. Yo, that's deep enough for me. I gotta like think. I don't remember, you did a deep question last time? I don't know, I don't, I don't remember stuff. My brain can't even remember what happened five minutes ago. Anyways, I think I go nuclear explosion. I think zombie apocalypse, no, it, it's it's tough. I'm, I'm just thinking like, I wanna try Fallout. You know, I played Fallout. I just wanna play in the world of Fallout. It's not gonna be fun and it's probably gonna be crazy, but I feel like if I live through it, I, I feel like uh, I have a better chance of surviving a, a nuclear explosion, you know, surviving the aftermath than I do a zombie apocalypse. I don't want to deal with zombies, I think they're crazy, but uh, maybe I'm making the wrong decision. Maybe my knowledge just isn't good enough about nuclear stuff, but I just want to give, uh, I want to give the nuclear stuff a try and uh, live in the world of Fallout for a little bit until I probably die because I'm not very good. Would you rather have the power to teleport or have the power to be invisible? I want hood. There's so many benefits to everything. Teleporting would be amazing just to go from place. Oh my god, if I never had to commute it to school or work, or if I felt like, let's go visit Jafia, bam, I teleport into Jafia while he's recording and I'm in the background like, That'd be funny, and he didn't notice, and then I teleport out. He doesn't even notice, and then when he's editing the video, he sees me, like, dancing in the back. Why is that the first thing that comes to my mind? Man, there's so much you can do with teleportation, and that's what I want to do. Okay, teleportation's cool, but I think I'd go invisibility. There's so much you can do with invisibility. You can sneak anywhere you want, and I mean anywhere. Mm. But seriously, I want to be invisible. I think that's cool. If I could be invisible, I could literally, literally go anywhere. And that's awesome. All right, mystery man left like five questions. I'll answer them all because that just makes the video longer. So let's go through. Would you rather be able to go to any one video game movie and live there or live in the world or go to any video game or movie but only be able to stay there for an hour? So I go there permanently or only go for an hour? I'm gonna go there permanently, but I don't know where I wanna go. I wanna go permanently somewhere, but I don't know where I wanna go. 
video game or movie? I can't decide. I would like have to think about that hard, but I don't want to go somewhere for an hour. I want to. I want to pick. I want to find like the best place that exists in a video game or movie. Like even if it's not what I've done before, just find the best video game or place and live in it forever. I'd do that. I can't even give you an answer though, because I I don't know where I would go. I'd have to really dive deep, study like every video game and every movie that existed, and pick the most ideal world for myself. And I I totally go in with that. I think that'd be fun. But I can't give you a movie or video games that I don't even know where to start. I definitely wouldn't pick Fallout though. I can tell you that much. Would you rather be super strong or super fast like Captain America or Flash? I'm gonna go super fast. I mean, super strong is cool and all, but I feel like super fast would be a lot more useful than super strong. At least for me, it would be useful because I don't have to have teleportation. I can just run everywhere and run super fast and, and get there just like that. I mean, I'm going super fast. I would love to run super fast. I don't see as much use that super strength would be besides like fighting bad guys, but I don't need to fight bad guys anytime soon. So I'm just gonna take my super speed. I think that'd be fun. Would you rather get rid of Iceberg or get rid of half of your subscribers? Iceberg, what do you think I should do? I would get rid of the Hater Tots YouTube channel completely because it is garbage. Whoa, 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 whoa. Iceberg, that was not an option. Rude, I'm getting rid of Iceberg, screw that guy. Would you rather have an awesome job that you love that pays amazingly or just be super rich and not have to do anything? These are both amazing options and obviously I'm gonna go to an awesome job that I love that pays amazingly, because that could be YouTube. I could, YouTube could be my awesome job that pays amazingly. Why would I be super rich and do nothing? That's not fun, I wanna be doing something. And if I could have my dream job and it pays very well, of course I'm gonna take that. I gotta take that. Final question from Mystery Man. We got two more from other viewers, but just from Mystery Man. Would you rather have all your college debts paid or have $200,000 in a retirement banking account that you can take out when you're over 60? You are running out of ideas. That is, that is very specific. This one's easy for me. I'm gonna take the $200,000. It's not gonna be much by the time I retire because inflation and all that, but I don't have any college debts. So it would be pointless to pay off zero dollars. I'm just gonna take my 200,000. That was easy. But thank you, Mystery Man, for all the questions. I appreciate you giving some valid feedback. This is good. This is, this is good. Makes the video longer, makes the video more juicy, you know? Final question here. Are you too late? No, because it's every two weeks. As long as you post a comment within two weeks, you're gonna be on the video. Wait, what? Would you rather never talk to your brother again or never talk to your other brother again? I mean, I happen to have two brothers, so this kind of works. Oh, I got an answer for you. I'll never talk to my brother again. Which one? <laughs> we may never find out. All right, everyone. Well, you guys left a lot of questions this week, so I appreciate that. We're going to do a couple or a few would you rather questions on either.io. So let's get started with this one. Would you rather be a hippie or be a gangsta? I'd like to be a hippie. They just seem so chill, seem so loving, seem so lovable. I'm just gonna hippie it up and be a hippie, people. I don't know if I wanna be a gangsta. I don't know if I'm fit to be a gangsta. I don't feel like I got the body the mindset to be a gangster, a good gangster. So I'm just gonna be a hippie. I feel like I can rock that hippie game pretty well. And this one's split 50-50. I guess I'm not too surprised with this. Would you rather be smart, but unlucky, or dumb and really lucky? I think I gotta go dumb and really lucky, because if I'm lucky, a lot of things are gonna go my way, no matter how stupid I may be. If I'm smart and nothing seems to go my way because I have terrible luck, then what's really the point of my smartness? I'm just gonna be a dummy dumb, and I'm just gonna hope the luckiness brings me through life. And honestly, with enough luck, it could potentially bring me places. Would you rather only drink carbonated beverages or never drink carbonated beverages? I'm gonna go never drink carbonated beverages because I currently do not drink carbonated beverages because certain carbonated beverages give me migraines. That's right, potentially they can give me migraines. Well, not all the carbonated beverages, but some do, depending on what's inside of it. So, 65% agree with me, which makes sense, because there's a lot more uncarbonated beverages 
then there is only. So you say if you only had carbonated beverages, unless you get like one of those soda stream like carbonators where you carbonate everything you drink, you're pretty much gonna be drinking soda. And that's it. So you probably have to live off of like those those carbonators and just it wouldn't it wouldn't taste good. There's non-carbonated. You have you have water, you have milk, you have juice, you have alcohol. There's a lot you could do with non-carbonated non beverages. I don't know why you'd pick carbonated. There's just more choice with the non-carbonated. You should be able to live without carbonated. Beer count is carbonated? It might. I don't know. I don't drink beer anyway, so it wouldn't matter for me. Would you rather never? Would you rather? <laughs> what? Who, who did this? That was confusing. I'm guessing would you rather never listen to music again or play video uh, dude, I play video games all the time there is no way I would ever pass up video games for music I mean I love my music but way more than I love my music I love my video games so I'm gonna obviously play video my whole life is surrounded by video games why would I not choose video yeah, oh I almost died there we're good though why would I choose losing video games over music it makes sense for me just to do video games so what about video games with soundtracks huh does that mean I can't play video games with soundtracks? Or is that a loophole where I can still listen to games with soundtracks? Or is it like you just take out any music from games? Either way, still playing games. Okay, this will be our final question. This is a pretty funny one though. Would you rather slam your hand in every door that you try to open or fall down every flight of stairs that you try to go down? This is so dumb. Either way, you're gonna be screwed over, but I think the one that has the least amount of pain is gonna be slamming your hand into every door. I'm, I'm kind of surprised that this is 50-50, but I'm kind of not surprised either. So, say you have to slam your hand into every door. So, every time you need to open a door, you're slamming your hand as hard as you can into it. But, every time you have to go down a flight of stairs, you have to fall down it. Now, I take a lot of stairs in my day. So, I think if I had to fall down every single flight of stairs that I went down, I'd become a... It'd be, it would be an issue. Yes, I know you can take elevators and then that wouldn't count as falling downstairs. You'd have to take elevators anywhere you go, but not everywhere has elevators. My bedroom is way up top. I have to take a lot of stairs to get there. I don't want to be falling down them every time I want to go downstairs, okay? I don't need that in my life. It'd be a lot of stairs. It'd be dangerous, but I mean, if I just get someone to open my door for me every time, I never have to slam my, my, my hand into a door. If the door's always open, I never have to slam myself into it. But you can't get around going downstairs, right? You have to go downstairs. Nobody can carry you down the stairs. It doesn't work like that. But someone can open a door for you and you won't get hurt. BAM! It took a bit of logic, but I figured that one out, people. All right, everyone, that is where we're gonna leave this episode here. Make sure to leave me a bunch of would you rather comments and questions. They're mostly just questions, but leave me a bunch of would you rather questions in the comments below, and I will answer them in the next Tater Thursdays of Would You Rather. But if you liked it, please do hit that thumbs up button below and subscribe to see more, and I will see all of you later.